lecture i am going to discuss about how to connect my sql with hedi sql so first here opening the hedi sql and this place first you need to click on this new button after that here you can see my sql or you can connect with the tcp named byte so tcp that selecting after that you can see library dl file for MariaDB. So you need to select here lib my sql dll after that this place give your ip address or your pc name or you should write your local host and thereafter root is the user and give the password and uh, port is 3306 and after all uh, giving correct information now let's uh, give you a meaningful name so this is uh, going to write here my sql underscore con my underscore sql con and if you give all the correct information then click on this open so setting my sql con was changed right click on y then you can see Hedi SQL that's connected with the MySQL. After that, let's go on Sekilo. You can see list of tables there. Okay, so this is here or list of four tables you wanna see. Then here you can see the size. This is the list of tables there. Created date, all those things you can see. And after that, right click on the, then you can do some editing, drop, create new, create data, export data, maintains and you can perform this all those things. Okay and uh, since that I selected here actor then you can see there is the index R2 primary key and index extra lost and or uh, thereafter here you can see this is the primary key and index lost. And you want to see the data, click on this data tab, then you can get the data of the circular.actor tables. And uh, here you can see uh, this is now uh, maybe 1000 records you can uh, get there. Now 200 is so uh, uh, total numbers of rows are there. And after that you can do so many operations there, you can write the query this place and execute the query there. So this is the also beautiful ID for MySQL, Hedi SQL, you should try. So I hope guys this video is the helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next video. Thank you.